What's up? This is Casey from Casey's Customs. In this video, we're going to be finishing up this 1952 Pontiac. We're also going to be doing a giveaway on this car. So if you're interested in how to win, stay tuned for details. Let's get going. How do you get into the giveaway? We're doing it the exact same way we did the last car, my F1000 pickup truck. There is a website in the description of this video. You click on it, and then that website, you can buy a sticker, decal, whatever you want to call it. They're $50 each, and if you buy a sticker, that gets you one entry into win the car. There's 200 spots available. You can buy as many spots as you want. We're going to be doing two drawings whenever the spots fill up. The first drawing is for the car, and the second drawing is for a thousand bucks cash. So even if you don't win the car, stick around. You might be lucky enough to win cash. The last time we did it, we paid out two thousand bucks to two different guys. So it's a pretty cool thing to do, and it's a great second place prize. Um, if you win the car, not only do you win the car, you win free shipping in the continental USA. If you are outside of the continental USA, you can still enter. I just can't do shipping. I don't understand how any of that works out. So if you're interested, click that website and start buying some stickers now. Let's get going. Okay, we are back on the 52. I tried to put the camera under there when I just replaced the entire fuel line. It was actually, it actually had a newer piece from the tank to, I don't know, about the rear wheel, but I replaced the rest of it all the way up. We're gonna throw some gas in it now, see if it holds and uh, I think if it holds, we're good to go. We're gonna call it uh, ready for the auction. So, we'll see what happens. Okay. Put about a gallon in. I saw a puddle, I got scared, but it was a puddle from earlier. Okay, we have all of our fuel lines running from the stock tank, primed it, so we should be good. I don't see any leaks, but I'm not sure yet. So. Let's hit the button and see what happens. <laughs> Pumping gas. I got both of those full. Looking good. Looking real good, baby. Cool. I got a new belt coming. It's supposed to be here tomorrow. I gotta put that on. Uh, so I don't wanna run it very long without a water pump, but. That is running from its own tank. All new lines, all new everything. Cool. I think she's ready to raffle. I didn't mess with the rear wheel cylinders. I have them when I was gonna do new rear seals and new brake pads in the rear, but the brake pads they sent me were completely wrong. So I'm not gonna just put wheel cylinders on there because to put the wheel cylinder on there, you gotta rip everything apart. Well, I'm not gonna rip everything apart and put the old pads back on. So I'm just gonna send those with whoever wins it. I mean, if, if a disabled person or a retired vet or somebody who just can't do the work has to have it done, uh, you know, I might work something out with them if they end up winning. But overall, I mean, you could, you could do that in, I don't know, an hour. It's not that big of a deal, but I would obviously get the right ever brake pads. Sweet, she's ready. Cool, man. Cool, 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 cool. So, wow, that video is cool as shit. Oh, I love this new camera. <clears throat> okay, so final details on the Pontiac. In case you are new here and you want to buy a raffle ticket and you don't know the whole story, it has sat in a field for 40 or 50 years. I have brought it in, cleaned it out. We put a clear coat on it, updated the brakes, updated the fuel line, updated the brake lines. Basically, we just kind of refreshed some stuff. Didn't get too crazy with it. Um, there's still plenty of stuff you could do, but I have made it so you can get in, push the start button, it'll fire up and you can buzz it around the block. Super solid. Not too bad. Really doesn't have any rust, nothing crazy. Like, I think my worst spot is right there. I mean, there's nothing, nothing super bad at all. Like, dash is very nice. Headliner is not great. It's falling apart, of course. But it's a perfect project car to get started on. Like I said, really nothing, nothing too bad. 
Good little cruiser. Has some little kinks like the key is missing from the back of that so you have to use a screwdriver it's got a little stuff like that like if you think you're gonna buy a 50 dollars raffle ticket and have a twenty thousand dollar car ready to go that's not that's not gonna be the case i do have a clean title for it it's still in the old owner's name from i think a different state uh if whoever wins it if that's a problem i can send off the title of my name just let me know whatever obviously but nice little build pretty cool good start i have entirely too many things right now is the only reason i'm not keeping it um it's it's super solid you heard the doors they open and close better than my truck i drive every day so pretty good little thing so if you want to buy a decal for it if you buy a sticker decal that enters you to win if you want any of the information on that it's going to be below the video there will be a website click on the website and then you can buy your stickers from there you can buy as many as you want they're 50 bucks each gonna be a lot of fun oh the website is up as soon as this is posted so as soon as this video goes live that's when the website's live and you can start buying you can buy as many as you want right on peace thank you very much for watching the website is live you can go buy the decals this second go on there buy as many as you want whenever it fills up we will do the drawing i don't know how long that might be maybe it'll fill up in a week maybe it'll fill up in a month i don't know we'll find out whenever it fills up we will do the drawing thank you very much for watching Please like, share, subscribe, all that good stuff they tell you at the end of videos, and check out some more of my other videos. Peace.